It's all about having high returns. That's why I give away on my website, thepropertyunleashed.com, a free deal analyzing spreadsheet. Why? Because too many people out there are doing bad deals. Whether they haven't got a spreadsheet to be able to stack the numbers, whether somebody or people out there are just letting people do these deals through their training or whatever, that's not what we do with the Rent to Rent Business Builder training program. If you have a deal on that and you're one of my students, you send me the deal, I will give you my full advice on whether I think the number's stacked, whether you need to tweak something, or whether it's all systems go, it's a hell yes, I would do that deal myself. You need to make sure that you're gonna get high returns from this. Now, some people say, well, if I'm gonna make so much from these properties, why doesn't the landlord just do it themselves? Listen, they don't want the hassle. They're not setting themselves up in the same way that we set ourselves up. Okay, so we set ourselves up with systems. We set ourselves up in such a manner that it's a business. And I always say you want to be a property business if you're getting involved, particularly in a strategy like rent to rent. So what we also need to be looking at is the numbers. How much do you want to earn? If you're doing HMOs, you want to be earning a minimum of £100 per room. So if you have a five bed property, you want to be making £500 a month after all other costs. You want to know what to say to the landlords, to the agents, to be able to make them come to the party and understand that by you earning that or making that sort of profit, you're going to look after their asset over the next five years. You're going to maintain that asset so that they're making even more money because A, they're going to make the guaranteed rent and B, their asset isn't going to start depreciating because it's being used wear and tear. It's not being maintained. It's not being managed properly. We will manage it to the highest standard. We will maintain the properties to the standard that we get them. If not, we'll make them a bit better in five years time. What a property prices tend to do over the long term is they tend to go up, don't they? So if their property is looking really, really good, they're safe in the knowledge that not only have they made that guaranteed rent each and every month, but equally to that, their asset is going up as well. For an investor, for a landlord, that is a win win for them. So that is something that you want to take into mind when you're negotiating your deals. And again, that's another thing that I go through with my students and I show them how to do things like that. I show them how to negotiate good deals that are a win win for all parties, because that's always what we want to be doing is doing the best deals, but making sure that we do the best deals and everybody gets a piece of the pie, so to speak.